hi there, Sharon. Hi, Brian. Uh, so, quick one. What social media platform do you prefer? I prefer Twitter of all the social media platforms because um, Instagram, I, I don't think I'm pretty enough for Instagram. I'm too ugly for Instagram. Not that I have self-esteem issues, no, no. Instagram, um, I don't know who set the standards or why they were set, but there are these two standards that are, that are there for Instagram. I use Instagram for my photography to display my photography. It's more visual than opinion. People focus on the picture other than what you have to say. Uh, Facebook, I don't think I have anything against Facebook. I just don't have the app, but I'm in Facebook. Uh, I prefer Twitter of all of them because Twitter I can talk, I can express what, uh, whatever I want to express and I feel like um, I reach many people in Twitter because it's just an opinion. Mostly I never use photos on Twitter, it's just what I have to say, just like a caption. But if I use this caption alongside a picture, people will focus more on the picture and not get the, the words. So yeah, that's why I prefer Twitter. And then also Twitter, I feel like it's the fastest way to get information. Like if you want to dab and a Twitter, a book at, Okay, I feel like Twitter ukitaka tu udaku ama the latest tea, just go to Twitter. You'll know what Mr. Gaido said about washing your man and what every other Kenyan has to say about that. Plus, um, yeah, basically that's it. If you want to get to know what's happening here now, just go to Twitter, the number one hashtag that you think end up. You'll know what's happening where and at what time and if you want to comment you can also comment if you want to keep making it trend uh, knock yourself out so what do you think about uh, the current trend in South African relation to the former players and secretary of Kitaba? <laughs> it was it was unfortunate for Gitaba. Um, I'm so sure he was he didn't think it would turn out it would turn out this way but it did so in relation to Twitter, I think uh, if it were it if, if it weren't look at <laughs> cut <laughs> if it weren't for Twitter, uh, such uh, wouldn't be exposed really because I wouldn't expect expect this to trend on IG or Snapchat or anything. And in relation, uh, we also had a similar incident with the deputy governor of Kenyaga County. I think so. In the, not so recently, but yeah, it happened here in Kenya, the same thing, only that it wasn't a young girl, it was someone else's wife. Um, I think Twitter is doing, can't say really great, but I think it, Twitter is doing a good job at exposing such things and making people be smarter in their affairs if they don't want it to come out and turn out this way. What, what do you think of what uh, happened? In, in conclusion, what do you think of uh, what happened to uh, Kobiki Hara? <laughs> okay, uh, Kobiki Hara, now, I, I have a lot to think about this issue. Let me just try to bring it to a bare minimum. So Kobiki Hara went ahead and uh, faked her life on IG. Basically, yeah, that's what I call it. Her life was just fake. Everything was fake on IG. But where was the expose? Twitter. Where did it trend? Twitter. You see why you should be on Twitter? Like, <laughs> yo, Twitter is everything. So this, um, I think, uh, I feel bad for Kobiki Haraya yeah, because uh, she, I can't say she didn't deserve it, but I just feel bad for her because yeah, she's human. She has feelings. That, you know, when the whole world is talking about you and how your shoes are fake and how your food is fake, it's, <laughs> it's annoying. <laughs> Uh, Twitter has a very bright future for sure because Twitter will forever be there. I don't think it's dying anytime soon. Facebook died. Not really died, but yeah, you get the point. Facebook died. Instagram is on its way there. There's always going to be something better, but Twitter, <laughs> I, I think, okay, I'm not saying this because I love it or maybe I am. I don't know. The future will just be bright okay. because it's, it's, it has a wide audience and it continues to reach to many people, even those that are not on Twitter. Because even this means, where, where do they originate from? All of, uh, most of them originate from Twitter. So, 
yeah, it reaches even those who are not on Twitter. So Twitter has a very bright future. So thanks a lot uh, for that video for letting us uh, have you. So wave at camera too, say goodbye.